Yo, this is Anthony coming to you live from the Paso Garage. What's up? Hey guys, let me tell you a little something, okay? Something's been going on. It's a little fishy, all right? I got my Facebook page uh, reported and I'm suspended only from posting in groups and commenting on group posts, okay? Right after, right after I put the petition out in a bunch of different groups on this past Sunday about bringing back Eddie DeBartolo and getting rid of Jed York. You're going away, Jed. I warned you a long time ago and you could do whatever you want to do, you could try to do what you ever want to, what you're going to try to do, but I ain't going nowhere, and you're going away, trust me, bro, okay, so that, that, that group, that, or that Facebook uh, uh, account got suspended, so then I created another one, so I could comment on people's posts in groups, and posts in groups, and two days later, that one got suspended the same exact way, okay? I can't post in groups, can't comment on posts in groups. But the funny thing is, okay, I got no email notifications, no notifications whatsoever saying how long it's going to be, just a, a, a Facebook notification that says you're blocked from using certain features on Facebook. So here, this is my point, okay? Am I getting in that in that head too much? Am I getting all up inside there, Jed? Is it that bad? Do you got people watching me? What's going on? I've never in the years that I've been on Facebook ever had any issues like this. And now all of a sudden I do? Is it because you can't even sell tickets to your games for $35, bro? Is that what it is? Is it because Uncle Eddie's coming back soon and you look like a jackass? Listen to me, Jen. I warned you. I begged you last year. It was a year ago, November. It's been over a year I've been at this. I said, Jen, I ain't going nowhere. I'm going to come after you. This guy in Chicago is going to be the disassembly project of Jed York. And I won't stop until you're gone. Do you feel it now? Nobody likes you. Everybody's against you. Everybody wants you gone. Leave. Concede like the politician you are. Get the hell out of San Francisco, Santa Clara, wherever you move the stadium to. All right. Get out of Levi's and go somewhere else. Let Uncle Eddie come back. Go work for the Bartolo Holdings, okay? And, and and just disappear. Because you're no good for this organization. And it's your parents that are suffering for it. Even though they had their own fair share of debauchery back in 2003, all right? We're going to get Eddie DeBartolo back into this organization. He's going to take over. Denise and John are going to be there still. They'll pay the bills like good little owners and figure out ways how to make more money for the organization. And Eddie will figure out a way how to bring this football team back to greatness like it was when he had it back in the day. Do you hear me? And if this is you, I know I've been tagging you, Roger. Roger Goodell, I'm talking to you. I've been tagging to you, you to a lot of posts, sending you emails and everything. If this is you trying to troll me and, and and get me blocked or whatever's going on. I'm gonna I'm here to talk to everyone, okay? You are not gonna silence me. There's too many people that are on board with this. There's too many people that support this. Too many people with the same brain set, mindset as I have. Your 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 efforts are just you're looking desperate. It's not gonna work. You're done, Jed. You're getting out of San Francisco. You're leaving the 49ers. And you know what? Stuff like this, like my number eight over here, is going to be back to greatness. Because do you know why? There's going to be an owner and someone involved with this business and this uh, company, which we are your customers. It might be a professional football team, but we're your customers of the company. We pay your bills. There's going to be an owner back involved with it that's going to want greatness for this team and do everything possible in his ability to make it happen. And you know what? I hope he brings his daughter Lisa into it. And I hope she learns it. And I hope when he's ready to leave, she takes over the football operations. Because she loves his team too. You know what? I'm not going nowhere. I haven't gone nowhere for over a year. You're gone, Jed. Your days are numbered. And I ain't going to quit until it happens. I said it from day one. And I'm still standing here. And I'm bringing you down. I'm 
I'm bringing down the bad dog, and I'm going to sit here, I'm going to laugh at you. He told you all you had to do was re-sign Harbaugh, so swallow your pride, and make decisions to better this uh, organization, and make it a championship franchise again, like we have the players to make possible. That's it. You're done. Pass out.